You don't deserve to be in a relationship if you're not content by yourself. I was talking to one of my friends and they were saying, oh, I really want a relationship, but I just don't like being alone. And let me tell you why this is important. This is very important because if you're not content alone, you're kind of like desperate. You're kind of like, okay, okay, I can't, like, I hate being alone. I need to find somebody quick, 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 quick. And if you're quick to find somebody, what do you do? You probably overlook certain things that you otherwise wouldn't usually because you don't like being alone. You rush the process and you say, oh, she's good enough because I don't like being alone. You can't do that because you just compromise so much more than you realize it. And honestly, relationships are best often when both parties are content alone and both parties are already happy alone. So I don't want to make this video too long. I just want to let you guys know that to be in a relationship, you need, you need to really have your shit together. You can't be like, oh, I just want to, you know, this. Yeah, I'm 18 or whatever. Like, it's not that serious. Well, okay, fine. But for the guy who's out there, I think you're going to do significantly better if you take this advice and say, you know what? I don't like being alone, but I'm going to learn to be alone. Because then when I'm with somebody... I can stand on my principle. If they disrespect me, I can be like, hey, I don't like that you do that. Please don't do it again. And you're not scared to walk away because you like being alone. And your whole mindset is different. You go from walking on eggshells like, ah, oh, you know, I don't want to get rid of them because I don't like being alone. But yeah, you know what? They treated me bad, but it's okay. Like, you know, I'll forget. Two, then I have built up a kingdom. I'm very content in life. I'm very happy. So now I'm adding, in addition, a girlfriend, a relationship, whatever. Now we're talking. Because you don't want to add anything to your kingdom that drops your peace of mind, that drops whatever and you're more aware of this you're more cognizant of this and you're less tolerant of it because you're not you've built something and your mindset is shifted to okay i built this thing i'm content alone and i'm gonna i'm gonna add a queen to my kingdom now and if she doesn't do her job and if she kind of destroys my kingdom, well, I worked hard for this so she can get out. So what I'm trying to say is, if you're content with being alone, you're simply building the skill of strength. You're strong enough to say, Hey, I'm going to add somebody to this. You're strong enough to walk away if it's not working out because you don't compromise. And you're strong enough to most importantly, love yourself. So don't, you don't deserve to be in a relationship if you can't be alone. Because honestly, I think it's very different if, if you can't be alone you're going to seek for wrong things. You're going, to, you're going to act too quick and you're going to be too tolerant of people who don't respect you and you're not going to have a backbone. But if you're content with being alone, you can say, hey, I don't like that. You're kind of like removing to my peace of mind. No. I was better off without you. You have like 
you have the composure, you have the strength to do that because you like being alone. And of course, many very various factors, but just start there. And hey, by the way, if you like this video, check out the description in the below free course. I really want you guys to check it out. I think you'll learn from it immensely.